So yeah, second day of the original chill. So much nostalgia. Hopefully there's a fishing rod or a net or something today. Letters is probably for the museum. Wrong button again. Oh goodness. Yep. The Far Away Museum cordially invites you to take part in this free fossil identification program. Send us any fossil you find, we'll identify it and return it promptly. Thanks for your support. From home. Strange. I've had a poor appetite lately. How about you? Have you been healthy? Are you having melted cheese sandwiches for dinner? Are you washing your knees? Knees matter. Love, Mom. <laughs> yes, indeed. Hey, my peeps, Costo. Here reporting for Deadville News. I've buried the greatest treasure ever in one of the D acres. Go find it. Usually someone new will move in by the second day. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. Well, let's go see Nook's tools. Oh, sweet. I thought that one died. They have cats mewing in the music. <laughs> Any other dead trees? Nope, not right now. choice anyway. Ah, net, no fishing rod. paper. Okay, let's get those fossil letters ready. Yeah, still no fishing rod, darn it. Well, at least I got a net, so I might have a chance of something today. We'll see. I passed my house. <laughs> Wrong button. This one. Yes. There. Dang, I used to write full letters to the museum every time when I first started. So now I just put emotes because I'm too lazy to write all that. Is 
That's a lot of letters. And that's just from yesterday. <laughs> Oops. Pretty sure I put something in there. So yes. Yes, identify this for me, please. Send the letters first, just before I forget. And it's one letter at a time. <laughs> quality of life already, but I still love it because nostalgia is a very powerful thing. <laughs> oh really? Sometimes it sounds like they actually say things in this one too. So cute. Geez, two cracks and one acre. Quasoid? And I can go treasure hunting because Costo decided to bury something in one of the D acres along that. Wow! <laughs> this is probably my favorite music track because it's so random. The chevrolet's gone. Ew. Before this was called the clouded yellow butterfly, I guess. I should probably talk to animals as I see them, but... I'm not really sure what I should be doing first. Alright. Okay, so she's gonna be on this for a few days. Okay, so I can't really ask Pudge for help either. Because he wanted a fish, and I ain't got a rod. for the bits again. This one might not last too long since I started so late and if no one has any favors to do or if I don't find many bugs. Then again, if I manage to get an hour out of this, that's still pretty good. If I don't, that's fine too. Because I think I played a city folk one time for only 30 minutes. So yeah, D acres. Ooh. Which begins here, I think? Nope, down one. Ooh. These are called tiger swallowtail butterflies instead of just tiger butterflies. Treasure hunting. Let's see what Costo buried. 
Well, of course, if I can even find it. sister's always right by the beach? I can't remember. Or if it's just random. Yeah, I might. Any goings on? From Sahara, the carpet trader. It's a door to a marker and seems to be in order. For May 9th. Okay. How the heck does original Sahara work? It's been so long I can't remember. Oh god. Well, hopefully it's not as a... Oops, I think I scared away a bug on a tree. Whoops. I really missed the meowing music. I want the kitty music! This is Taker E. Up. I don't see any cracks. Although that is kind of, even though the acres make the town bigger in this game, um, I do kind of miss like the round moving, mostly because um, I can adjust the camera so I can see behind trees. This one I can't, so I might miss out on the crack that Costo buried. Oops. And she wants more flowers around her house, so I should probably buy more flowers for that favor of hers. No cracks here. So I guess I check up there on the hills. Ooh. Oh, yay! A modern end table, nice! Thanks for the treasure hunt, Costel. Or Costel. I don't know pronunciation for French names. Yeah, that's so that's so amazing. I never thought to lay down paths. Mostly because Wendell usually gave me kind of cruddy ones, but maybe you, you could probably make your own if you don't like it. But still, I never bothered to do that. The best I could do was just try to organize certain um, buildings next to each other to make a theme. But even then, it's like I didn't lay down paths exactly from to mark where I wanted the um, wind turbine. Dang. Makes me want to try harder for the new town I made on New Leaf, but at the same time I start looking at the amenities and then I'm just like, I don't know what to do! Ugh. Yeah, I wish I could. But then again, I'm not sure if it would be worth it because my town would be so ugly. Because <laughs> I don't put that much thought into where stuff goes or making it look nice like that. Can you put stuff on top of tables in this one? Like, will this go on top or no? Yay! Ooh, cool. Got some weird noises going on here. Hmm. 
Yeah, you might as well just stream that bass fishing and make a certain Paul Heb super happy. Oh, Custo's over here. What's up, frog? Hey, good afternoon! I'm absolutely wired today. How about you? You peppy? You jolly? Wee wee? Oh yeah, killer timing. Both borrowed my Pokemon Pikachu and won't give it back. I don't give that full of the old Bama. Those two are just borrow, just give each other stuff, and I think they're too afraid to get it back. Sure. Just stay here. Ooh. Ah! Uh, no! No! Ah! Uh. Rolf, where are you? Oh, hello. Ooh, angry right off the bat. Oh wow, that's actually surprising that it's harder um, without the gimmicky controller. I mean, you'd think it would be gimmicky, like you know how the Wii stuff was with the Wii remote, but I guess, oops, sorry. I guess that worked better. Picking up Cranky Cat. Look at it, actually it looks like one. They actually have the picture of like little pet system thingy. If I can find enough of those tiger butterflies, I might get some decent money to finish paying off the house. Here you go, Custo. That was easy. Dude, that's my Pokemon Pikachu. I'm so stoked you brought this back for me. Thanks. Ah! <laughs> I hate when they give me paper. with just that one thing there's just the Pokemon Pikachu you have to get sometimes from someone as a favor but other than that it's not really too much other Pokemon references green sleet snow or hail will deliver what you mail I still remember that it's so cute okay pause it Ugh. I guess 2000. I'm going to Nux again for flowers. So I don't want to be completely broke. 10,000 smackaroonies. Or bellaroonies in this case. You can see him flying away. So I guess I go... Well, I gotta buy flowers for Bubbles' house. And see if that's good enough for a favor, which probably it isn't. Hmm. Dirt floor and everything and a cobweb. A writing chair? Nah. Okay, wait, where the heck is Blathers? It's all the way down there, so just keep going down. Time to give some of Blathers' favorite things. Oh, crack. Oh. 
another gyroid. Should probably sell this one so my room isn't full of gyroids. At least the menu works fast enough. If it was pretty slow, it would be annoying to keep swapping your tools in and out like this. What errand have you at the Wishing Will of Deadville? How are things? Apologize, what's this? This is the Deadville Wishing Well. This is where one comes to learn the status of things in town. When things are well, many travelers will come to visit Deadville. But there's still more wisdom in this well. If someone has given you something, that for some reason you're unable to deliver or return, you can come to this well and apologize and leave the item here. There's no shame in apologizing. Sometimes it is all one can do when things go ill. Mm. Okay. Yeah, you should probably shower, you'll feel better. <laughs> A thousand pardons, so terribly sorry. Splendid! Yeah, priceless item, you get a butterfly. <laughs> Proggles, you see a what? You're not touching them, Black. There's an old saying among some of my contemporaries, butterflies are beautiful, yet moths are monstrous. Well, if you were to ask me, I'd say they're all the same. By which I mean disgusting. Truly horrific, what what? <laughs> I love flathers. Yep. Yeah, pretty much. That's probably why I love leather so much. <laughs> Unfortunately, that he repeats what he says sometimes because he doesn't have something for everything, so he's just repeating the butterfly thing. But still, truly horrific. I look at butterflies from a distance, but it gets near me, I run from it just like it was a wasp. <laughs> Personal space! Yeah. Told you I flail around with any bug. Don't like bugs. Aw, oh, another same one. Okay. Got a dragonfly. Grave, have you ever peered closely into a dragonfly's eyes? Blech! Ghastly, really. Oh, that's it. Nope, nothing. Okay. So I sell that, and I plant those two flowers. God, I hope tomorrow there's a fishing pole. In the meantime, catching a crap ton of bugs it is. And Bubbles wants flowers, so hopefully she'll be happy with this. Dang it, I scared away another bug! There. Hello, Z4 Bonet. What's up? It's all, it was like that at the start. I remember... I don't think I got the fishing pole mostly, but I just played a lot because I was so obsessed about the game. Flowers. Yay, she's happy with it. The storefront? 
Wait, isn't that super huge? I'm gonna go back and check it out then. And also, yesterday I I only remember being there being one tool, but today there was two. So I don't know if there was another tool and I just never saw it. Or maybe you just really do start off with the one tool. If the storefront is what I think it is, it's not gonna fit in my house. I still have a shack. Wrong button. Yeah, that's kind of huge. I'll keep it, though. Oh, I can't put furniture in there! I f oh, man, I forgot you can't do that. Dang. So used to the new uh, Animal Crossings. This is rough. Mm, I can get rid of the sandbag. Yeah, who am I kidding? I don't exercise. <laughs> Let's get this here. Uh, I guess I'll go to the beach and get some seashells and then ooh, look for more bugs along the way. I kind of miss that like jungle theme when you catch stuff, but I understand why they made it you know, quicker. Freedom of running! Yeah! Let's see if I can get the last 10,000 or so bells to upgrade my house. Ooh, another crack? Wrong button! Oh, why I keep doing that? Oh god, another fossil. Yeah, nice to see Animal Crossing fans wherever they may be. Lazy letter writing. Dang it, I want the net. I think tomorrow Sahara's coming, but I don't remember how she works. It's been so long since I played this. Oh, I'm full already. Uh, swap it for the common barfly. They don't do nothing. sell everything almost one by one. Still good money for a shell. Sell them all. Ugh! One seashell was better than two of those little butterflies. I'm gonna sell this. Two white scallops. That's like 900? Yeah! Get them bells. Oh goodness, this takes so long. <laughs> Ugh. Go faster! I'm impatient. Ooh, 130 for one dragonfly? It's pretty good. Oh, okay. <sighs> All right. Um, I guess I'll see what the mega obloid sounds like.
Nope, don't want it. <laughs> Already realized I didn't want it. Sell those other two letters if I'm allowed to. Because he just started. Oh, bug? Nope, it was a leaf. <laughs> Whoops. Yep, I can mail more letters. Get so many fossils to donate tomorrow. Dang, that brings back memories too. The electronic thing in the post office was like for the e-card reader, which wasn't taken advantage of too much, but I think it was pretty cool. I think I might have gotten one pack of the e-reader cards, but I don't even remember what they do. Dang. Wait, where am I going? Oh yeah, the beach. Oh, more seashells. And along the way, more buggies. Can't do favors for Pudge because he wants a fish, which I cannot do. I can't do a favor for... Um... What are you looking at? Is she looking at the... Oh, there's a mole cricket, that's why. Oh! At least I can catch it in this one because they kind of help you. I should bring that back. I should bring that back uh, for the mole cricket at least. So Gladys gets another bug. That's a rather ugly bug. And in this one, when you do go fishing in the ocean, you actually have to like cast out farther and let the current carry it to the front of the beach if there's a fish there. I guess just for convenience sake, ah, uh, there's a gull over here. But yeah, I guess for convenience sake, they um got rid of that just so that it will be easier to fish. Oh, that was quick. What the? Oh yeah. I slipped and fell off the boat again. What I mean to say is, it was pirates or sharks again. Something like that. What do you mean, are you a real sailor? Of course I'm a real sailor. Sailor, sailor. Would I dress this way if I weren't? Although, it is a pretty cute outfit, isn't it? But that's not why I'm wearing it. I'm wearing it because it is part of a time-honored tradition. We sailors are a proud and noble breed, men of the sea, rough and rugged, with an impeccable fashion sense. Oh, so you just get the item right here. Guys, my shipmates, they think that maybe if they tie me to the mast, I won't fall off the boat so much. Sails stay full and your socks stay dry. So this is actually going to be kind of hard for furniture because I can't actually store furniture. Ooh, a tiger bobblehead. I want that. I think my house is already too full though. And I'm also full here. I can give the mole cricket the blathers. Alrighty, see you later. Please, I must insist we leave it in the container. Particles, you see, a what? Mm -hmm. 
My, 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 good gracious, this is a frightfully large mole cricket, eh, what? Yes, rather large indeed. Interesting, isn't it, how its monotonous song drags on and on while the insect itself is nowhere to be seen? Hmm, to be nitpicky, it's actually not a true cricket. Blech, oh, let's talk of bug legs, simply dreadful. <laughs> Butterfly's not worth it. Ugh. from just seashells, dang. Lion's paw. Ugh, those kinda suck. Oh, I'm so close. Oh, yeah, I want that. I think I only needed like 10,000 more bells to pay off the first house. I'm so close. Let's put this tiger bobblehead away. Because it's special and I want it. What a weird mishmash I got going here. Look for more buggers. Hopefully at least dragonflies. And in Wild World and City Folk, I think they took away the ability to hold the button and sneak up on them, so it made catching bugs kind of hard sometimes. Later, Z4. Thanks for dropping. Uh, thanks for dropping by. Have a good one. Whatever time it is in your time zone. To him. I shouldn't ignore him. Sweet. That dude will buy anything.
Hmm. Yeah, seashells don't come back that fast. I think I was over here. Oh, jeez. I think this is a pitfall, though. No? Jeez. Oops. Nope, not it yet. Alrighty, that's it. Ooh. Oh, well, I can actually... Right there. Two more slots. I got doubles instead of like a random thing. <clears throat> if I can get one more, that would be nice. right there. I mean, not another one, but that's worth decent money, I think. Oh, so close. thousand eight hundred fifteen left. Oh boy. Let's see how much stuff I get from this haul. And it's right there. Might as well catch it. traps are the worst. Oh, I'm so close. I keep finding bugs. stuff in here. 
Oh, no, wait, it's my stuff, right? Well, almost. The work uniform is left here. I can sell the paw shirt. And I guess the other stationery. <laughs> Digging in the dump. Mm, I still like the bloom shirt better. Probably because of blue. Do you have a favor or anything? Okay, nothing from him. Oh! None of these, they're just not worth anything. Oh, I didn't want to catch it, I was hoping to scare it away. Oh well. They were still all happy. so rough not having a fishing rod <laughs> but I am almost there just from all the seashells uh not much I just got like 6,000 bells in total um or at least saved up before I paid off some of the debt and I only have like 3,000 more to go so I might be able to pay off the house even though I'm just getting crappy bugs I guess it was because thanks to all those seashells though, I got some pretty good ones. Two more spaces. Freaked out blathers a lot. Freaking bubbles is in the way. <laughs> yeah, blame it on her when I just can't always catch bugs. Yeah, hooray for bills! <laughs> Don't want Tom Nook sending off the sending the raccoon to the raccoons to get me. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
200 piece. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh, combo offers aren't that bad. Ah, uh, not enough. Almost. I think I need like 1,000 more. Yeah, one by one sales kind of sucks, so it's best to try and get as many of the same items or stuff you want to sell as possible. Just so selling stuff will be quicker. I played it when, you know, with the, with the real original first town. I think I played so much on a rainy day that I think I actually managed to get multiple cola cans. Dang, that was super lucky. I need more bugs. Thank you. More bugs, I think, probably come around when you plant more flowers. It's usually how it always works. I think. <laughs> ah, what the heck? Why to run away? I wasn't even near it. Four more spaces, come on. Ones, but I'll take what I can get. Fossils.
gonna make it oh I made it Step done. Hoorah. Mm. I'm completely debt free. Yeah, for about one minute for the walk to Tom Nook talk about expanding the house. Actually, less than a minute. Thanks much. I very much appreciate you paying off your house in such a timely manner. You're a dynamo, yes? You're quite responsible for someone your age. Don't be shy. It's normal you want a bigger home, hmm? And as more furniture comes, more happiness. Please! So I guess I'm gonna end it here because I'm actually getting a little bit of a headache so I'm gonna take a break or this might just be it for the day. Yeah, thanks for stopping by to watch. And I guess we'll just continue this tomorrow. At least after Pudge saves the data for me. Thank you again, and later!